What's up, what's up everyone and welcome back to another episode of Niger Meat Science. To my new viewers, please check out my previous videos. I greatly appreciate it. Thank you. Alright guys, I'm going to need a quick favor from you guys. If you could just smash that like button or subscribe, that would be greatly appreciated. Thank you so much. I just came from work. I work the morning shift. I'm super tired. It's beautiful outside, but I'm in here knocking this video out for you guys because I love you guys. Alright, enough of my problems. Let's get started. So today we're going to make our own DIY gas mask. Yeah, gas mask. Like this. It's right here. Oh, two seconds. Gas mask. Whoa. Gas mask. So if you don't have a mask like this, I'm gonna show you how to make a mask similar to this using a soda bottle. All right, so how does it work? A gas mask has two features that prevents us from inhaling toxic contaminants in the air. The first is a particle filter that kills any bacteria when you inhale with your gas mask on. So basically, it's just like a barrier that blocks all the toxins from reaching your face. So when you breathe in, it filters out all the toxins before it reaches your nose, mouth, and lungs. So the second is a chemical process that's called absorption. Through absorption, a solid or liquid can trap particles on its surface. Similar to a way a cigarette filter traps toxins when you're smoking. So now that you know a little bit about how it works, let's go put it to the test. Let's go make our own DIY gas mask. Let's do it. Alright guys, so as always, before we start an experiment, we're going to need materials to actually do the experiment. So in this case, we're going to need a soda bottle. Um, try to get a clear soda bottle. I kind of messed up and bought like ginger ale, which is a green bottle. I wasn't thinking about it at the time. So we're just going to use this for an experiment. But try to get a clear soda bottle. Um, just get a can of soda or anything like that. Um, and, just, and just cut it in half. You need those, like a, you know, those little soda can bottles or any can that you can find. Just cut it in half. Um, some duct tape. Some cotton balls. A sharpie, some rubber bands if you could find any, um, some scissors, a knife, and lastly, you need some carbon activated charcoal like this. And I'm gonna put a link to all the descriptions of where you could find these so you can do it on your own. Cool? Sounds good. So, our first step is to use our sharpie right here to cut out an outline of where we're gonna cut to make our mask. So, let's go ahead and do that. Um, let's do a little something like this. Cut like that, and then cut all around here, down, cut all around here. Cool. Whoa. All right. So once that's finished, you're gonna have something like that. Let's just cut it out. Just gonna make a hole right here. This is super unsafe, guys. <laughs> I'm just gonna use the scissors and make outlines. So once you finish cutting out your outline, you're gonna have something pretty much like this. And this is pretty much your base of your mask. Um, and next, you see how the edges are super rough? We're gonna take some of our duct tape right here and then we're gonna put it around the edges so you know it could fit nicely on our face. Alright, so now that we've finished putting our duct tape around our face mask, um, it's gonna look something like this. I know it's not visually appealing, but yeah, it gets the job done. Alright guys, so as you can see, I put some holes through the bottom of the can. This was extremely hard for me. I couldn't do it on camera. Um, the knives, it's super hard to do it with a knife. For me, it was just super difficult. 
But once you get past that face, you're gonna have something that looks similar to this, not so confusing, but it's gonna look something like this. So you're gonna have this. All right. The next step, we're gonna take out cotton balls like this, and then we're gonna put, just spread them out like this, and then put it at the bottom. Take another cotton ball. Put it at the bottom. Spread it out something like this. Put it at the bottom. Take another cotton ball. Spread it out. Put that at the bottom. Make sure it's all surfaced. All right, so you're gonna have something looking like this. We're gonna take out carbon, activated carbon right here. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, our carbon charcoal. And then we're gonna just dump it. Let's make sure this is good. And we're just gonna dump it in. Oh, we're gonna dump a couple inside here. Perfect. So we're gonna have something looking like this. You can see it. Carbon charcoal right there. Finally, we're gonna take our cotton ball. Just put it at the top. Spread it out again. Something like this. And spread it out. Put it on top. Take this. Spread it out. Make sure you don't rip it, but just spread it out a little bit. Put it on top. Take the last one, spread it out. Put it on top. Cool. So you're gonna have something looking like this. Like that. See, cool. Cool. Let's put this back down there. We're gonna take our mask like this. See our mask? I'm gonna just push that straight up there. Just gonna push that straight there. And then take the bottom and connect the mask to the soda can at the bottom. Like that. I try to get it as sealed as possible. Uh, I'm not doing a good job. Like that. Take another piece of your duct tape. Continue sealing. After you seal it up, you're gonna have something looking like this. Make sure the whole thing is sealed at the bottom. You see in the top, that's how pretty much it looks. I can't see it on the, the camera, but yeah, this is pretty much how it looks. And then, you're pretty much all set. And then, if you want, you could just put the rubber bands and make like a headband thing. If you see what I'm saying. All right, so that's pretty much it. I just added a little headband so it could fit more snug on your head when you put it on. But that's pretty much it. Um, the carbon charcoal fil filters the air um, right here. And yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Hope you guys create something similar like that. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. All right, that's pretty much the video, guys. This is pretty much it. I hope you guys liked the video. Please like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. My name is Nigel. This is Nigel Meets Science. Thank you guys. Peace.